With the anticipation of Avengers Infinity War, there has been many speculation of which villain would be a part of the film. Joe and Anthony Rossi say that in Infinity War there's going to be a lot of unexpected characters, including villains. Based on this description, no villain is off limit. We could see bodies we've never seen before, those we've completely forgotten about, or even see villains rise from the dead. The possibilities are endless, but we've narrowed down the list to the biggest bandits that will most likely appear. So these are the seven confirmed villains we know so far. If he gets all the infinity stones, he can do it with the snap of his fingers. Just like that. Black Dwarf is one of the strongest and most powerful members of the Black Order, and we can expect to see him in the movie under the name Kul Obzitan. Portrayed by Terry Notary, Cole Obsidian is a giant fierce fighter with impenetrable skin and superhuman strength. In the comics, he was sent to invade Wakanda and secure an Infinity Gem. Could we see him doing the same thing in Infinity War? There were six singularities. Then the universe exploded into existence and the remnants of these systems were forged into concentrated ingots. Infinity Stone. The Collector. During the end credits of Thor The Dark World, we see Lady Sif and Vostage giving the Collector the Aether, or the Reality Stone, for safekeeping. When the Collector asks why they were giving it to him, they reveal that the Tesseract is in Odin's vault and that it would not be wise to keep two Infinity Stones together. <laughs> Proxima Midnight is a member of Thanos' Black Order, as one of the most skilled fighters in Thanos' command, she has superhuman strength, speed, and durability. However, her most significant powers come from her spear. Yes. Corvus Glaive, another member of Thanos' Black Order. He serves as Thanos' right-hand man and is known to lead the Mad Titan armies into battle. Just like his wife Proxima Midnight, Corvus Glaive has superhuman strength, speed, and durability, yet relies on his weapon for most of his powers. What did you the Outriders. These creatures have telepathic powers and can read people's mind by sinking their hands into their target's temple. They can also make themselves invisible, fly, and control their solidity. With these powers, guys, they are a greater threat to the Avengers. You can see these creatures go hand-to-hand -hand combat with Black Panther and Captain America in these clips. Ah! Ebony Maw is the last member of Thanos' Black Order. Although he is small in stature, don't underestimate his power. Maw is a psychological mastermind with the powerful ability to persuade people into doing anything he wants. Run from it. Destiny still will... Loki. It's still uncertain if Loki is a hero or a villain. There's no doubt that he will be Infinity War. We've seen him in the trailer offering up the Tesseract, and we last saw him in Thor Ragnarok being approached by Thanos' ship. However, the real question regarding Loki is which side he will be on, good or evil. And we leave the best for last, Thanos. For the past six years, we've all been waiting for the Mad Titan to get out of his computer. And now that epic moment is finally here. But this <laughs> does put a smile on my face. Portrayed by Josh Brolin, Thanos hunts for the six Infinity Stone as he attempts to destroy the entire universe. So which other villain do you believe will be in Avengers Infinity War? Comment and let me know. Otherwise, if you like this video, like, share and subscribe.